welcome back to my channel. So today, as you guys can tell by the title, I have another X Plus Wear haul for you guys. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel. I really, really do appreciate you so, so much. You guys are really, really watching these X Plus videos. I really do appreciate it. I tell you guys all the time. You guys are loving it. I do want to touch on one thing, okay? Just very, very briefly. I do see some comments where some people are not happy uh, either with the shipping um, or the ordering, the sizing or things like that. Listen, I will never steer you wrong when it comes down to giving you my honest opinion, okay? And even though I may be working with a brand or whatever the case may be, I am still always going to be honest of what their clothing is like, what, what you know, all that, okay? I truly, truly do apologize if you are not having a great experience as I am. I'm going to be completely honest. The clothing that I have gotten from X Plus Wear since I have ordered from my very first video, I have been truly satisfied. And I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on with the ordering. I'm obviously not there to see what you guys are ordering. I have given you as much information as I can when it comes down to what I recommend, how you should order, and what you should order when it comes down to your sizing based upon my sizing and the measurements that I've given you guys. Some of you women are a lot smaller than me. So that's why I'm not understanding what's going on. The clothing that I have has been perfect, okay? I wanna say out of all the items that I have received, I wanna say maybe two or three items didn't fit, okay? But everything else, and I have tons of clothes from them, have been great. So I do apologize if you're not having a great experience. Listen, everything is not going to fit everybody, even if it's a true to size brand, it's not always going to fit, okay? There have been torrid sizes, fashion and figure sizes, Lane Bryant sizes that I have tried, that I've worn that were in my size and it didn't fit. So it may be based upon your body type, it can be a lot of factors, okay? But I just want to throw that out there. I see you guys comment. I do reply as much as I can. It will not go unnoticed. But I will let you know, and I want to let you know, that even if I am working with a brand or whatever the case may be, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to never steer you wrong. What you are experiencing, I do apologize. What I'm experiencing is, um, you know, it's, it's different. And I'm, I'm sorry. Um, but I do believe in this brand. I do like them a lot. The clothes that I have gotten are beautiful, are great. The material is great for me. And I, I'm sure a lot of you women are a lot less, you know, a lot smaller than me. May, your back may not be as wide as mine. Your butt may not be as big as mine. You know, so I don't, I don't know what's going on. I'm not there to see what you're ordering. But I can say if their clothes can fit someone who's you know heavy chest at the top got a big butt big butt as you guys know you know hips thighs a big stomach that's the that's the number one thing to make sure and hope and pray that clothes fit is it fitting my stomach and if you can get on my stomach then you can pretty much get over everything else okay and the fact that these clothes fit given all those factors I don't know what's going on ladies i do apologize but i'm not gonna act like it's not there the comments are not there i'm not gonna act like i don't see it i am truly sorry if you're not having an experience all i can say is definitely hit up their customer service listen you got a problem hit up the customer service absolutely i will put the link down below as far as the customer service email and also on the screen by all means let them know and x plus where if you are watching this Read the comments. Some people are not happy. Address your customers. Let them know what's going on. I invite you guys to do that, okay? I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, you know, no, no. Listen, if there's an issue, by all means, address it, okay? And I just wanna let you guys know that I'm a real person on this channel. I am not just to sit here and blow smoke up somebody's butt, if, if it's, even if it's not true or whatever the case may be. I'm going to be honest. I am an honest person, okay? Now with that out the way, let's get into these fashions. They have sent me some great stuff. I'm super excited to show you guys. Oh, and also, listen, my Instagram, okay, it's so much going on. I know, I'm gonna get to the clothes, I promise you. My Instagram, so I, I no longer have at Monet's Curvy Closet, this one right here. Um, long story short, I'm sure you guys all seen what happened with uh, Danny Lay and the baby. I made a comment 
they felt like it was against community rules i made a comment on the shade room so they took away my instagram so this is my new instagram okay monet's underscore curvy underscore closet Please, 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 please follow that Instagram. That is my account. It will say new account on there. It's me with the pink lipstick. By the time you guys see this video, you should see a picture of me posted there. I'm not sure what picture is going to be posted, but follow my new Instagram, okay? I do no, I no longer have access to that old Instagram because Instagram was being a hater, okay? And it wasn't anything bad. It really wasn't. I wasn't cursing. I wasn't degrading anybody. So, you know, so yes, go ahead and follow my new Instagram. Please, please, please go over to my new Instagram. I no longer have access to the old one. All right, Simona, you've been talking too much. Let's go. Okay, so here we have this beautiful two piece. Uh, listen, okay, I am a girl that loves two pieces, okay? I love a good set. I love a good set. And not only do I love a good set, but I love a set that has leggings to it with a long, drape flow type of shirt top to it and this when i seen this i was like yes i gotta have it in my closet okay of course i will put all the information as far as the links down below the sizes and the price and the actual name of the outfit all of the sizes should definitely be a size 5xl you guys know that is what i wear with a lot of these brands um that are very similar to um x plus wear i wear size 5xl so this set here, first of all, the colors is popping, okay? You have the light blue, baby blue, however you want to call it. Then you got the regular blue, you got the white, you got the red, you got the navy blue. Like, this is popping, the pattern, everything. The feel, the material, it is very, very much stretchable. Let's start with the leggings, okay? Let's look. Look. Stretch, okay? Stretch. This is... Yeah, I had no problems getting into these leggings, okay? None whatsoever. I know sometimes it may have elastic around the waist, but then when you pull them up, it doesn't have as much stretch in the thigh area. Lies, okay? This here has stretch. You see that? You hear that? It got stretch everywhere. All about my kneecaps, okay, girls? It's stretch everywhere. So your kneecaps, your ankles, and all that is going to fit into <laughs> these leggings, okay? It does have an elastic around the waist here. This is what the back looks like. I know I always gotta shake my butt, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, and pardon the lighting, okay? Listen, <sighs> you girls always on the move. I was working earlier, and so I was getting myself together and I'm losing the natural light, so work with me. That's why I'm kinda going fast so you guys can see. You know, daylight savings time already happened, so it's getting dark. <sighs> But we're gonna do this, okay? And then you have the top here. The top has this little asymmetrical, you know, slant here to the side, which I'm definitely feeling. What I also like too is you can actually not wear the leggings with these. You can wear this both of these two different ways, right? You can actually just wear the pants with a completely different top, or you can wear the top with a completely different bottom. So you can make two extra outfits out of this. Um, the arms here, they have the elastic around the arm, so it's a lot of stretch right there. It's a lot of stretch underneath here, so it does give your arms the, whole, the, the good room that you need, okay? And then the top is a very much off the shoulder top, which I think is really, really cute, okay? I wasn't expecting that at all. So this off the shoulder, you can either do it to the side if you want, okay? Or if you want to do the off the shoulder look here in the middle or well, if you want to rock it to this side you want to do it off the shoulder okay any kind of way that you want to do it you got it okay the pants also if you guys can see i hope you guys are liking the angle i know you guys said some of you guys said you do so i'm gonna keep doing it here which will allow you guys to see a lot more at the bottom um but as you can see it does go down all the way down past my ankle and i want to say a little bit underneath uh the heel of my foot so i think that is a great length I would definitely wear this with a nice heel. Um, I would not wear this with a boot because it's definitely going to take away from the legging, the style and everything. But I would definitely rock a nice, probably like a gold, probably a gold heel. And I say gold because, let me walk up close. I hope you guys can see here. These are like, you know, these are chains, okay, in the pattern. And they're like brownish, goldish color. 
So I will definitely wear a heel that would bring that out. So I hope you guys are able to see that. But yeah, so this is this outfit. I showed you guys the information about it. Let's go on to the next look. Okay, so here we have the next outfit. Well, actually it's just the top, not the bottoms. Um, but the next, this top though, this top is completely different. This is completely different from anything that I would order. So I'm definitely, you know, when I place these orders, I do try to, you know, order something that's a little bit out of my comfort zone or something a little different than what I would normally order or what I would normally wear. Um, but I thought this was really, really cute. So I definitely wanted to get some different bottoms. I was going to maybe get like some lighter jeans um, just to bring out the blue a little bit better. But I kind of like the dark denim. I don't know. I'll probably still go with the light blue. But anyway, this top is so cute. Okay, so first of all, we have the light blue, dark blue. Okay, so we have the different color going, different color pattern going. All right. I will say, okay, this top is a size 5 XL. I will say it does have spacious room, as you can see. Like, it does have a lot of room. I would definitely also wear some cute leggings. Because of the flare, it does definitely give me, like, a baby doll type of vibe. So, I would definitely wear some leggings, too. But anyway, I will say the shirt itself, the material, it is, very, it is, it is definitely very much a shirt material. So, it does have that... Um, you know very limited stretch but it has room if that makes sense i will say here in the arm area it is a little tight okay right here it is a little tight but you know do it i'm gonna bust like a can of biscuits um the back is a little bit tight so if i do that i do feel like i'm going you know just shred it rip it open um but i can wear this all day i can get away with wearing it all day without feeling like i'm too tight so I will, you know, give that factor um, underneath here is a little tight. So I would say, you know, about giving it a little bit more room underneath the arm area. So pretty much the top, the arm area, the back area, the shoulder and stuff is fine. Um, but I will just say, you know, around the arm area. Now, maybe because I have thicker arms is why it's feeling tight, which goes back to what I was trying to say earlier. Even though you have something in your size, something still could not fit because maybe it's you have thicker arms than you thought you know you have thicker th you know calves than you thought you know what i'm saying so this is my size but it still fits tight around the arms i do have big arms so that's just something to really think about um the collar okay pop your collar here i'm really really digging you can either wear it up or down if you want but i myself may try to wear it up this would be cute if i had like a high bun and then you pop it up Listen, we're going places, okay? Um, and then you do have the, the button down here. What I thought was really, really cute is it does have two drawstrings. So, and I have not done this because I wanted to wait till I got on camera to, you know, pull it, I guess, in and see what the look looks like, okay? So, you have this look now, and it does have a little tail in the back here. It is very, very long. It does come the very back of my knees here. So it is very, very long. I did not button up the wrist here uh, because I didn't feel like it. But even if, if I wanted to, it still has a good, nice size to it. So it does kind of drape over your hand, um, which is cool, which is what I like. Or if you're one of those girls that like to roll up your sleeves, roll up your sleeves, girl. Okay. Now let's see what this do. Let's see what this. I'm scared. For, well, one thing I know, it definitely uh, drew some more attention to my butt. But, you know, not really all bad, you know. Okay, so, it just drew it in. Oh, that's kind of cute. What y'all think? That's kind of cute. Okay. It's cute. It's different, you know. And then if you want to unflare it, it's cute. I mean, either way, okay, all right, either way, that's cute. So tell me what you guys think. You know what you guys should start doing? Rating the outfits, okay? Also, again, please make sure you follow my Instagram because your girl, this is an opportunity for me to, to really upgrade my Instagram, really start taking some really cute professional looking kind of pictures, you know, going outside, different scenery and stuff like that. So please believe a couple of these outfits will be looking like your girl stepped her game up okay so 
please follow my Instagram. You will see all these outfits. Well, maybe about two or three of them. You will see posted on Instagram. And I'm telling you, and I'm gonna really dress it up. I'm gonna really I'm put the shoes to them, the, the purse, you know, all that. I'm gonna really dress it up. So just make sure you follow my Instagram and get all of the deets, okay? Um, but I really like this. This is a really cute shirt. Like, this is really cute. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Okay, so here we have the next look here. It's um, just the top here. Uh, these pants are not, or leggings are not from X Plus Wear. Um, but the top, so we obviously are into fall. I can already tell you, I just put this on and I'm already hot. So it's definitely working. It's definitely a sweater. Um, but I thought this sweater was really, really cute when I seen it online. Now, I will say, disclaimer, um, the, the person who had the outfit on, if I can find a picture, I'll show you guys. But the model who had it on, it was very much giving the long overflow big uh, sweater dress with the thigh high boots. So I was like, oh, that'd be cute. And then clearly we have two different body types. Of course, she was a, you know, a little cute, little petite or thick little girl. So it may have fit her where it was a big overflow sweater, you know, oversized sweater um, feel. But clearly a little different for me. Um, but I still like this, this sweater. It's really, really cute. I really, really like this. I don't know what to call it. Like that, um uh i don't have i mean I, I don't have the proper word right now but you guys you clearly know well here let me show you i really really like this here this pattern this this design that they're doing now i think it's really really cute i think it's re really <sighs> the dog anyway i think it's really really cute i think it shows on the back too well here on the sides I really do like that it still drapes over my butt at least. Like I do like that factor of it. That it still gives me that long drape look over my butt. This is a size 5XL. This is a really, really light lime green yellowish type of uh, color. So really, really bright but perfect for the fall and even winter. I am sweating bullets right as we talk, um, right as I'm speaking. Um, I'm hot and my wig is sliding off. So we're gonna hurry up and uh, move this along. But I do like it. I wish that it did come a little bit longer, maybe around here. I mean, I mean, give me that effect that I thought I would see, you know, on um, on the models. Let me say this too. I told y'all I'd keep it real. Yes, a lot of the times what you see on the models, and that's with any brand, what you see on the models is not going to always fit like you girls. And I've said that before. There was a dress that I had from X Plus Wear. Um, if I find a picture, I'll pop it in here. The dress was really, really long on the model. But when it got to me, it, sorry guys, my camera cut off. But um, what I was saying was when I got the dress, it was not long as at all to when, what I seen on the model. It came about, I wanna say here. And on the model, it was like draping down, you know, to her feet um and so i was like hmm okay but again i always say and i've said this before what you may see on a model it may not look the same on you now i do think that that dress definitely gave an illusion where it was going to be a nice long dress and it was but it was not as long now i also took into effect maybe she's shorter than me maybe she was smaller well she was smaller than me Maybe she's shorter than me. So that is why it looked the way that it did, right? So I always just like to, you know, take that into effect. And um, the model who had this sweater on, she was clearly a lot smaller than me. And she may have been a lot shorter than me. So the, the sweater may have fit a lot uh, different than it does on me. So I just say take it to an, uh, to an effect um, and think about those things when you are ordering. Do not, do not do not think that what you see on a model is going to fit exactly you the same the point of a model is to show you give you a overall view of what this is going to look like but it's not ex going to be exactly the same so just want to say that girls okay i'm just trying to help mm. um but yes i'm getting hot let's let's get out of here this is this is my wig is gonna be on this floor okay okay so here we have another shirt 
you know I had to get this shirt. They actually had a lot of shirts that were dedicated with these little nice cute quotes for BBWs or curvy chick or you know whatever. They had a they had a lot of nice cute um tops that had these cute little sayings, okay? One dope BBW, okay? You know <laughs> she is. <laughs> This is so cute. You know I had to get it. It is a really cute hoodie type dress type feel. I definitely, okay, definitely if I could, I would rock this top by itself. Now, I'm not going to be, you know, that risque, okay, and not have anything in the bottom. But I was definitely thinking of doing like some fishnet stockings, okay, and some thigh high boots, honey. This will be so cute, okay? I just think this is so cute. I think the whole legging, and you, you, y'all you know I love my leggings, so the whole legging with the the tightness and it got the, you know, the nice pockets on the side. It got your butt, okay, protruding. I know you see it, okay? <laughs> like, this is so cute to me. I am one dope BBW and so are you, okay, girl? Listen, I need to give me something that says Curvy Cutie Crew. Okay. Just wait on it, okay? Just wait on it, okay? But um, it has a drawstring. It is a hoodie, okay? Let me see if I can. Uh, let me separate my wig, okay? G -g give you the full effect of the hoodie. Uh, uh, okay. No, I'm definitely taking pictures. This is so cute. Uh oh. <laughs> Ew. This screams. Mm, mm, mm. This definitely screams um, fall vibes, okay? Mm. Okay, nothing too much to say here. It is definitely, definitely roomy. It does uh, fit, well, obviously it's supposed to fit tight because, you know, well, I don't know, I don't want to say tight, but, you know, your girl has thick thighs at the bottom, so, you know, what you expect, but it is definitely comfortable. It does have a lot of room here in the arm area, so I don't feel it's no restrictions or anything like that. I can wave my hands in the air, wave them around like I just don't care, okay? This is very comfortable. I am definitely rocking this. Thank you. Now, the next out, well not outfit, but the next top I wanna show you, I can actually wear it over this. But I had a different look in mind, so you guys let me know which one you like. Hold on. Okay? Uh, uh. Yes, girls. This is a denim jean jacket a long denim jean jacket if you are a big girl and you know how hard it is at times to find to fit in any kind of denim wh whether they're pants okay whether they're listen any kind of denim that involves stretching over your curves you know can be a very hard task, okay? And to not only find denim jeans that fit, but to find a denim jacket that will fit, and a long denim jacket that will fit, ladies, you know. You know, you know, you know, okay? I was going for a different look underneath, but whatever, rock with me, okay? Lean with it, rock with it, okay? But, um, Listen, because we know denim don't have a lot of stretch for us, okay? Unless they're like jeggings denim where it's a stretch of a legging mixed with a denim. But I will say, I can't button it, okay? I want to say, I have to clarify, I think this is supposed to be a denim jacket and not a dress. Because I know that I ordered it as a jacket, but then I was like, oh wait, since it has all these buttons, it's supposed to be a dress. No, I, well, you can wear it as, as however you want to wear it. I can't obviously wear it as a dress because it doesn't, it doesn't allow me to close, okay? But that's fine. That's fine because for me, wearing it like this, like, I feel like, 
Was it the Matrix where it was Samuel Jackson in a long black coat? Was it the Matrix? It was somebody. No, was it Blaze with Wesley Snipes? It was somebody who had a long black jacket, right? And was just cool. And it just, like this long just makes me feel that. It just, listen. And actually you can wear this as a actual jacket. Like I'm talking about like, like a, not just for style, but for, cause it's cold outside. Like it, it does have some thickness to it. It's not like one of them flimsy, thin, you know, less thin material. This is a nice, really nice, solid jacket that you can really wear outside. Listen, okay, now what I was saying was I thought it would be really cute and I think I've seen one of the models who had the hoodie, the uh, one doe hoodie underneath this and she was rocking I think with some thigh highs. I was actually thinking about doing that. I was thinking about doing that. But um, I'm just not like a layer type of girl. Like I feel like I'd be real hot. Um, but I'm hot in this and I only have a crop top long sleeve shirt. But this... Do you see, I, I, you, as you notice, I got a lot of the like ripped material type of fashion style. I have this in the lime green. Like I'm trying to get into it y'all, I really am. Um, but it's, oh my God, and it, so it got trick pockets. So it has like the little lining. Let me see, let me show you. So it has a little lining as if it's a pocket, but <laughs> it can't go nowhere. But look at this, okay, this is what the back looks like. This is so cute. Oh my God. Like, I listen, I'm not giving this. No, I'm not. Like, this is staying in my closet. I'm sorry. This is definitely staying in my closet, okay? This is so cute. Oh my God, my God, my God. I can just go on and on. And what I also like too, now I don't know if it's just, no, it's, it's the way that it's made. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but it definitely has a little cinched waist type of style. So it looks like it was made that way where it just want to accentuate the waist just a little bit, just a little bit and give you a nice accentuated, <sighs> listen, girls, go get you one, go get you one. Okay. No, you cannot have mine. I'm not, no, get out of my closet. You can't have it. Go get you one. Okay. Okay. Ladies, we're switching gears a little bit. Okay. Now, I don't know if you can tell, but I definitely was trying to get a variety of style within this haul. So I got some really obviously formal, you know, looks. I got some really less, you know, go hang out looks. I got some really less add a heel to this and be cute looks. So I was trying to give a different variety, right? And I seen this outfit and thought it was really, really cute. Now, here's where it goes, which is what I was saying earlier. This is my size because it definitely does fit all around here it fits really comfortable there's a lot of room as you see you got a cute little slit to it all of that but i may just have an, a little wide back you know what i'm saying I may have a little bit more wide of a top area you know what i'm saying my bust may be a little bit big you know what i'm saying because i can't zip it on the side <laughs> i can't zip it so that's why i was looking like this okay this is supposed to be a one shoulder and it's really cute. You have the nice little see-through, you know, type of look here, okay? Really, really cute. I'm really feeling it and I'm really digging what they were trying to do, but you girl can't fit it, okay? Well, I'm not gonna say I can't fit it. Um, I just, you know, I just may have a little extra, you know, may just have a little extra. And see, that's the thing with me, okay? And I, and I, you guys can obviously form your own opinion but for me, just because one part of an outfit doesn't fit, I'm not going to sit here and say, well, you guys don't have my right size or I can't fit none of their clothes. Like I said earlier, I, I, you may just got a bigger back than what you thought, girl. Don't mean the whole thing don't fit. I thought that this was going to fit me. It's really, really cute. Everything else, it has room. I have no restriction. It's just... Now keep in mind, I do have a bigger top. If I was not so top heavy, this probably would fit me. But your girl is packing up here. What you want you to do? If you have a pair of pants that's your size and you can't hike them up, if you have hips, your hips is bigger than what you thought. If you got butt, I have a, I've tried on many jeans where they were my size. But your girl, baby got back. 
So I couldn't fit them all the way up, you know, because of my butt. So I would not just count out something because, you know, one thing or whatever didn't fit. Okay, I just want to throw that out there. Anyway, I really wish this would, you know, have worked out, but it didn't. Um, I do think this is really, really cute. Um, not sure what I would wear this to. Like, I would really have to go to a formal, formal place or have friends that throw formal events. And um, I don't have either. So, I wouldn't be wearing this. But I would definitely say if you were not as top heavy as I was, this can definitely fit somebody my size. I mean, I can zip it up a little bit. But when I try to pull this side, and I'm because I'm trying not to show y'all all over here. Um, when I pull this side and then pull the back to, together so it can zip up, it's, it's not working out. And I really do think it's because I do have a large top area. So, um, but that's okay. That's fine. Otherwise, I do love it. It does have that extra curtain type of material layer, I would say. Um, and it has a split here. Again, it has stretch to it. This is great up top. Um, I don't have any restrictions. I don't have a girdle on. Um, it just it fits comfortably. As you can see, it is floor length. So I do like that. But I think this is really cute. I do. You can probably even wear this as a cute prom dress. So, yeah. If anybody is interested, oh, don't forget to check out my website, Monet's Curvy Closet. Listen, I need you guys to go over there and check out my website, okay? There are items that I do from this haul and I put them on my website for you guys, okay? If you see something in particular that you like and you don't see it on the website, let me know. Um, this item, I I don't know what I'm gonna do with. I'm obviously not gonna wear it, but sometimes items that I don't sell, I do take it to play those closet. So if you like this dress and you think you can do something with it or work your magic with it, let me know before I take it to play those closet um and you know give it to them so let me know monet's curvy closet.com i do put the outfits on there okay okay so here we have our last outfit i am coming through with these bright colors okay this outfit actually reminded me of another outfit that i had uh with x plus wear which i will pop the video here at first i was like wait a minute did they send me the same thing but i was like no it's just it's a very 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 much the same exact color um, but I'm all for bright colors, y'all know that. So I thought this is really, really cute. Another asymmetrical look. I told you I am all for the uh, the set. So we have very much similar to the very first outfit that I showed you guys. We have the bottoms here, the leggings here with the asymmetrical top um, going slanted to this way. Now, I will say that, first of all, a lot of stretch like the first one. A lot of stretch every single place. A lot of stretch as you can see it does come over the heel of my foot so it is very long in length it's a lot of stretch in the shirt area okay there's elastic around the arm here so we good we good okay what I kind of am not feeling um the, this kind of material it is very much a very um, stuck to your skin material which means you can see your cellulite, okay? So let me just come up to the camera and so you guys can see. So you see how, hopefully you guys can see that. You see how you can see all of my cellulite. Now don't get me wrong, okay? Because your girl is still popping, cellulite or not, okay? However, I do like to have a smooth look as possible, even though I know I don't wear, you know, my shapers or anything like that when I'm doing my videos. When I'm actually going out, out, of course, it's when I wear my shapers. Um, and so, you know, sometimes there's certain areas that are exposed that you can't wear a shaper to. So, for instance, you, you got my whole thigh out here. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, I can wear a, a shaper that's, you know, here to my, to my thighs. But because this is a very thin and very stuck to your skin material, you're going to see that lining if I was to wear a shaper. So that's not gonna be cute either. So that's the only thing that I don't really like about this is you can really see what you're working with <laughs> as far as your skin. So I don't know, like I, I would definitely love to wear this. I would definitely love to wear this. And then like you can really see, 
you know, my, the lining of the pants. You can really see through. Okay, sorry, my camera cut off. All right, it's getting real, real dark. Dark. My camera like, girl, would you come on and hurry up? But anyway, I would give this outfit like a six and a half, seven, um, just because of those things. So you guys let me know. And also, like I said, rate the outfits down below and let me know what you think. Let me know what you guys think of the outfits as far as how would you rate them? How would you even wear the outfits that you see on my videos? How would you wear it? What would you pair it with? A lot of you guys do give your suggestions of how you would rock something, so that is definitely cool. I'd love to see the ideas that you guys have, how you would style your outfits. Um, so yeah, so just let me know. And that's all we got, y'all. Listen, I thank you guys so much. You, I say this and I mean it. I promise you, I mean it. You have no idea how, listen, you can ask my family, I talk about this to my family all the time and how much it means to me to be a successful YouTuber and content creator as a plus size influencer. You have no idea. Like, the, I don't want to go into a whole thing because we'll be doing this whole video, you know what I'm saying, again. But I just want to let you guys know that you are making my dreams come true by watching my videos, okay? And this is something that I love to do. This is the one of the things that I've always been passionate about um, for a very long time now. And I've found my calling. And by doing YouTube, it's going to allow so much in my life to happen, to become successful, to be, to be able to flourish. So just thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate you guys. It's tons of plus size influences on YouTube that you can watch. And you chose to come back and watch me. And I just, I appreciate you guys. I will always do my best to be honest. I don't care. I don't care. Because it's going to happen when I become successful and be, you know, that girl. Okay? Who's going to be, you know, in the magazines and stuff. It's going to happen. Trust me. <laughs> um, but when even when that does happen, please understand this. I will always be who I am. Monet's Curvy Closet, a.k.a. C. Monet. I will always be real. I will never let a sponsorship or anything like that allow me to produce fake content or fake views. I will always be honest. I will always let you know what it is about that brand. I will always let you know what it ain't about that brand. I don't care what the sponsorship is. I don't care how much they will pay. I don't care. I'm gonna always be honest because the whole point of me doing this is to let you know what things look like and what clothes look like on a real body right not a thick thicky thick girl with hips like a real body with stomach and cellulite like a real body right so that's my whole point of this and also embrace my real body okay so that's the whole point of this this is why i do what i do it brings me joy it gives me passion it makes me excited to do these videos and you guys are making my dreams and will make my dreams come true i know you guys will and i appreciate you in advance for doing that i will look back on these videos and realize man simone wow like you was you was really getting it and yeah so thank you guys so much if you want to even know my backstory and how all this came about i do have videos i will click the link above and you can just click on that and give you a background about me and who i am and things of that nature so anyway let me stop talking because i talk too much thank you guys so much follow my new instagram monet's underscore curvy underscore closet which is right here oh how can i forget my code is still popping y'all really buying that stuff because y'all Using that code left and right, honey. Listen, MCC15, use that code to get 15% off your whole entire order. It is still active. It is still going strong. I appreciate, appreciate, appreciate you guys for using it, okay? I definitely do. Um, MCC15, use that code, 15% off your whole entire order. You can use it as many times as you want to per order. Do what you do, girl. Okay? Do what you do. Monetscurvycloset.com. I appreciate you guys. Monetscurvycloset at gmail.com. If you want to write me, tell me something. I don't know. Whatever it is, follow me on my new Instagram. Follow me on my Facebook. All the links are down below. 
I appreciate you guys.